Hi everyone, it's Angie the Craft NATO, and I'm here again with another unbagging. Uh, this time our order today comes from One Day Saving, and they have been generous enough to give me a code for an extra 5% off your order. So if you would like to use that code and get 5% off, um, you can just put in, in the checkout at in the coupon code. Um, line craft nato zero five off and i'll put that code in the description of this video um also so you don't have to remember um because it's a little bit of a mouthful you can see we have our helper back there in the corner today bo duke has decided to come in and give us a hand with this unbagging so let's see what we have he's excited too he's coming under the table so i only have a few things in this order but they are going to be good things, I hope. And let's see what we have. I had to open the first, I had to open a couple, actually I had to open all three of them um, to check and see where this order was from. Um, I've been ordering so many gnomes lately that I had a hard time remembering just off of looking at one where this order had come from. So this first one is a full drill, 30 by 40 centimeter diamond painting. It is a round drill kit. Um, it has 23 colors. We got a key on both sides. We do have DMC codes and the key is made up of only alphabet. So that is very helpful. This is a picture printed uh, diamond painting. So you have the image was printed on the canvas and then the drill field superimposed on top. That helps with seeing lines like the Christmas tree outline, the outline around his nose, around his antlers. Those are going to show through behind the drills. So I like this one because I like that the background is kind of a mottled, textured background. So it's not going to be a lot of multi-placing and just plain all one color. It kind of gives it definition and a little bit of a 3D effect when it's finished. And um, that image is going to just pop off the, um, the canvas a little bit more. So like I said, you're not going to have a lot of multi-placing. You can see that there's all different symbols up there for the background and I love that I don't so much love you know confetti is I like a good mix I like a mix of color blocking and confetti um, or I like to switch off between the two um, have a couple canvases going at one time both you know that afford me the opportunity to do both so this is um, gonna give me that chance all in one painting because we do have some color blocking down here in his beard in his hat He's got these cute little reindeer antlers. He's holding a Christmas tree. And what's he holding in his other hand? Oh, a little uh, reindeer. Cute, cute, cute. So that's adorable. And he's got his little shoes on. And he's my favorite kind of gnome with his eyes not showing. Um, uh, the drill field is very clear. So there's no going to be no problems in seeing the symbols on the drill field. And the canvas is very sticky. Um, so we won't have problem with having runaway drills or drills sticking to your arm when you're leaning your arm on. You're not supposed to do that, but I do. Leaning your arm on there uh, to see what you got going. So we've got a standard drill kit with a boat, a pen, a plate of wax, and a few baggies. Everything you need to diamond paint. And here are our drills and our drills you guys love this, a lot of people do. Our drills are pre-baggied. So, let's take a look at our colors and see what we've got. 23 colors. And they're probably in order in here and I'm gonna mess them all up. So, actually, maybe I can do this without messing them all up if I just separate them out in my hand here and we can run through them on the screen. No, that's not. Well, maybe it'll work. Let's see. How much time do I want to take to do that? No, we're not going to do that. That would take forever. So we've got a lot of this uh, taupey color that's going to be our background. Another big bag of a little slightly darker color of the same that's going to also be for our background, I'm assuming. We have a very light gray, a dark, um, 
a it's like a brown it's like a brick color we've got a dusty lavender we've got mint moss green we've got a rose mint green um let's call that a tan dark purple probably black or let's see Yep, that's 310 black because we do have DMC codes on the outside of the drill packages as well. We've got a pink, a very light pink, burgundy, gray, gray, uh, rose red, dark cranberry, very dark brown, a lighter brown, a palish yellow, and a tan and a cream and these look like these look like really good drills there's some pin pricks in the backs of some of them but they're definitely not concave and pin pricks are just fine in the back as long as you have enough space for them to you know adhere to the um, canvas and there definitely is there's you know I'm not seeing any concave drills at all so those are the colors that come with that first diamond painting I'm just going to pop them back in there real quick so we keep everything together and we'll move on to the second one. In case you are wondering and you haven't heard me talk about it five bazillion times, these paintings are getting ready for November. Uh, myself and Mindy from Mindy's Diamond Moment will be doing an event in the month of November where we'll be working on gnome diamond paintings and invite you to work along with us. And there is probably still time to get your gnome diamond painting if you order it now. Um, and you might not get it by the first, but you know, pretty close to it. So this is the second diamond painting. It's also a full drill, 30 by 40 centimeter. And it also has 23 colors. And it's like a companion piece to that first one. If you look at them together, so we've got the boy gnome with his reindeer antlers holding his Christmas tree with that mottled background. In this one, we have the same kind of mottled background, except we have a cute little girl gnome with her Christmas dress on, and she's holding a couple of elves with her little Santa hat on. Kind of a Mrs. Claus hat. Um, very cute. And she's got her feet propped up. She's super cute. I like this one a lot. So this toolkit doesn't come with baggies, but you know, it's luck of the draw, I think, with uh, with toolkits, with whether or not they come with baggies. This diamond painting also has pre-bagged drills. And they're also, um, they also have the DMC code on the drill as well. Uh, this drill field is also nice and clear and the canvas is sticky. I wouldn't worry about my drills sliding all over or running away on that one at all. Um, the canvases also are pretty pliable, so I think they're gonna they're gonna flatten out nice and easily. Um, just leaving them under something heavy for a couple of days. You can also roll them backwards because they're poured glue. You can do that um, if you have like creases where the uh, cover isn't sticking to it like it's been pulled tightly from shipping you can peel your uh, top cover back and lay it back down and cover up those where those creases were and you can see where I did that up down here it's lying a little bit more flat than where I didn't do it up here where we've still got a little bit of um, separation between the uh, clear cover and the canvas so we'll do that again on this end and just roll it back on ever so nicely. And there, now we're gonna lay a little bit flatter. It just kind of relaxes that clear cover against the canvas and lets those creases uh, fall through. All right, let's see what we have for colors on this guy. These look to be, the background colors are a little bit darker so we have some light brown to dark tan, some very light gray, a beautiful Kelly green, 
a pink, blush pink, mint green, brick color, a peach, a green, bubblegum pink, 3064, which is that mauve color, dusty purple, another green, a true purple, a very dark green, a mauve, a cream, some 666 red. I was surprised there wasn't any 666 red in that first one. Uh, 608, like orangish red, gray, quite a bit of 321 Christmas red. This is what I think of as Christmas red is 321. I like that tone of red a lot more than I like 666. Some black and some tan, a big bag of tan. So that's probably also in our background there. So slightly different tones for the background, but the same general idea of the modeled background. And this is gonna be a fun one to do. I like all of the, I like the fact that the background is um, not just one block of color and it's gonna give it, you know, it's gonna give it kind of a three-dimensional look when you're finished with it. And I think that'll look nice. So let's round this out and see if our third one is a gnome. I don't know. I don't know. Is it? Could it be? Oh, of course it is. So this order is three Christmas gnomes. Now this canvas on this one is a little bit more stiff. Um, so I'm going to roll it backwards and see if we can get it to lay down. Settle out a little bit. And we'll see what this one is all about. So, <laughs> I love these guys. This is also a picture printed uh, diamond painting. And this one also, this doesn't have quite as distinctive of a um, modeled background, but it definitely has different symbols in the back, but there are like groupings of different symbols. So that's going to give it an interesting effect, and I'd be interested to see what colors we have back there. Let's see, we have N, S, H. Let's see, N is 3024 gray, S is... 3770 gray, and H is 950, which is a little bit of a little bit more of a pinkish. So let's take a look at our drills. Well, the drill field, I just showed it to you up close, is nice and clear. Um, this is also a 30 by 40, but really more of a 40 by 30 because it's, you know, oriented landscape rather than portrait. I'm going to try to let the cover, pull that plastic back and let that cover relax, see if we can get this to lay down for us. And wow, this canvas have a, has a lot of sparkle to it. I didn't notice the sparkle on the other canvases, but now that I'm now that I'm looking at it, I can see that they do have some sparkle to it. But this one really has some sparkle to it. Now, if you're having a problem with these stiffer canvases, getting them to lay flat, you can also roll them the other way. So, in other words, roll them, you know, lengthwise and perpendicular to the way that they were originally rolled for shipping, and that a lot of times helps to flatten them out as well probably telling you guys things that you already know, but just in case there are any beginners out there watching, you know, and it is, sometimes it's nice to hear it a, a second or third or tenth time. So we have a standard toolkit with this one with a boat, a plate of wax, and a pen. And these drills are not pre-bagged. These are in strips, which is just fine with me. This one has 24 colors, all letters and numbers for the, for the key. Um, I didn't test the stickiness of this one. Let me do that. Yep, this one is nice and sticky. So you got your three gnomes, each with their holiday hats. How many gnomes do you think, you guys, I can get done in one month? I don't know. I'm going to try. I'm going to give it a valiant effort and see if I can really knock them out of the park. All right, let's take a look at our 24 colors. These drill packs do have the DMC codes on the drill packs as well. 
They have that silver stripe with the with the light blue. Um, these have always been really good drills for me and my experience. But again, I think drills can be batchy. And don't blame me if you get some in this kind of drill pack and, and you have problems. Um, the drill packs don't look dusty at all. And the flats all look nice and flat. And I don't see any trash. I see a straggler in there, but that's bound to happen from time to time. So we've got pink, green, Christmas red, brown, green, mustard, gray, Kelly green. Uh, what color is that? 814, my favorite 814 burgundy, tan, green, dark green, navy, peach, another dark green, an army green, Two big bags of gray, uh, two different tones of gray. That's going to be your background colors for sure. Um, this rose color and a brick color. And then we have this um, blush peach color, which is also going to be a background color. So you're going to have these three for the background. That's going to come together in a, a mix and look really nice together. Um, then we have this uh, light, um, kind of a tannish pink, another army green, darker, a rose, like a mauvey rose color, and a teal color. I wonder where that's going to go. That's interesting. I don't see where that's going to go on there. Let's see, 3816. Is a W. Where's he going to go? Oh, down here in this guy's beard. And it looks like that's all. Or not his beard, but the border of his beard and his shirt. How it's a little fringy right there. So that's where that color's going to go. I don't see any other places where that color is going to go. So they've given you quite a bit of drills for just a few symbols. So I don't have any concerns, just based on looking at that, that you're going to have a problem running out of drills with this painting at all. So these are the three gnomes uh, for today. Um, again, don't forget that there is a 5% discount if you use the code CRAFTNATO05 off. Um, I'll put that in the description along with links to these canvases and a link to the website. And if you have any other questions, feel free to contact me in the comment section of the video. I'll get back with you as soon as I can. And I hope you guys all have a great day. Thank you so much for watching and for subscribing. I do appreciate everyone's support. And uh, thanks, you guys. And I hope you have a super great day. And I'll see you in my next video. Talk to you soon. Bye, guys.